Hey card fighters, Chris here from Vanguard Central bringing you a Dark Zodiac Venom Dancer Leap Joker deck profile. So starting off the grade 3, so obviously we have a 4 Dark Zodiac. His skill is you're going to be able to discard a copy of a unit on your Vanguard circle, which is going to be either him or the mate, and you get to lock your opponent's front row and rear row, front row and back row, rear guards, and then his legion effect is when you legion, you get a counter blast one, and then you can omega lock all your opponent's rear guards. So you're going to start out with him, which sets you up for Star Vader Venom Dancer, the main boss card of the deck. The non-legion skill is going to be counter blast one, Star Vader specifically, so it's a special counter blast. And then if you have another unit in your middle column, you got to choose one of your opponent's back row units and lock that. And then the bread and butter for the deck is going to be his legion skill. So after he attacks while you're in legion, you can counter blast one. And for each of your opponent's rear guards that is locked, you get to restand one of your own rear guards. So ideally you want to like lock four of their rear guards and then you get to restand both of your rear guard columns for even more attacking power ending the game. So next is going to be the grade twos, running four mates for Dark Zodiac to maximize his um, Persona Blast-like skill to lock rear guards, and then um, Astro Reaper's effect is going to be when you hit the Vanguard when he attacks, you get a Soul Blast one. Search your deck for, sorry, sorry. It's going to be look at the top five cards of your deck and choose a copy of a unit that's on your Vanguard circle and put it into your hand. Next, we're gonna run three mates for Venom Dancer, Sword Viper. His effect is while you hit a Vanguard, while you're in Legion, you're gonna get to lock another one of your opponent's rear guards, which is great because you can lead off with him and they're gonna wanna block it or else they have to lock another unit, you're gonna get another restand off of Venom Dancer. It's just a great combo. Next is two Neobiums. With all the locking in the deck, we're gonna get plus 2,000 every time your opponent's rear guard gets locked, which is good because it adds a little, a little extra pressure because they don't want this guy to hit because he'll hit, lock, give Neobium power, and more restands, just bad news. And then the last of the grade twos is three Osmiums. When he hits a Vanguard, you get to choose one of your opponent's locked cards and Omega lock it, which is going to keep it locked for the next turn. Hope you consistently get restands with your Venom Dancers after attack skill. Next, going to the grade ones, we have four Volt Lines, which has the same skill as Osmium except when it boosts. So you kind of want to split him up with Osmium, so no matter what rear guard column hits, you're going to be Omega locking units which is just super pain in the ass for your opponent. Next is going to be four Lananthiums. When your opponent's rear guard gets locked, he gets plus two. Same idea as Neobium, adding extra power whenever you lock things to get those high power columns, which you get to restand with Venom Dancer. And lastly, obviously we're going to do four Prometheums, four perfect guards. Gotta have perfect guards. Block those scary attacks. And lastly is the triggers. Going pretty standard with eight crit, four draw, four heal. And lastly, we are gonna run two of the starter Robin Knight. His effect is while you're in Legion, you can counter boss one, move him into the soul, and then log a front row and back row unit. So he's great for setting up Venom, Dan Venom Dancer. If you don't get to Red Dark Zodiac first, and we're running the extra one, just so you can get even more locks, keep pressuring your opponent with Venom Dancer v stands. In a worst case scenario, you draw him, don't use him, get an extra 10k shield. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, and if you have any questions, comment down below and let us know. Vanguard Central out.